Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog of my quarantine days. It's been pandemic and all are going through tough time in their lives. Hope we will overcome this situation soon. So stay safe. It's first day of my quarantine. Honestly, feels like this is a heaven on earth. Spend a lot of time here. Kids and my hubby are still sleeping. Hubby must be very tired as most of the distance was covered by him only. I had a very bad headache and could help him only in a small stretch. One thing that I noticed after entering Kerala is here everything is back to normal. People have started their work but with extreme care. We reached here yesterday that is 14th of May. It took almost 30 hours for us to travel from Mumbai to reach my native place Aramangalam. Distance is only 12.50 km and could cover in 20 to 22 hours if we try continuously but we gave prime importance to our safety. Even if the roads were empty, we didn't speed up much. Also, we took breaks time to time. No need to tell much. The risk in driving on Indian roads are much, much higher than Corona threat. When we took turn to the road, which leads to the house where we are going to stay during these quarantine days, I don't know in what state my mind was. A mixture of many feelings. This is my brother's house which is located in an awesome location with a beautiful view of paddy fields. So going back to nature. This house is vacant now and we will be staying here for the next 14 days under strict quarantine. Our state has given us all the support to come home and the guidelines to follow to keep us and the society safe. So we should strictly follow that and be a model to others. Good night. I love being up early to start my day by watching the beautiful sunrise with my tea. So peaceful. The first thing that I do in the morning is to check what the COVID-19 numbers were and that would just make me so disturbed and anxious. So I have been trying not to check the mobile in the morning. Just come and relax here. Look at the tractor surrounded by the cranes. They might be getting earthworms or something while plowing the fields. Just in one day, I have seen more than three varieties of birds and there are a lot more to see as I could hear sounds of different birds around me. So I have added one action to utilize my quarantine days, that is bird watching. During this lockdown period, the screen time of kids has gone up so much and even after pushing them to play, they want mobile or TV. So I give some activities which keeps them engaged and away from the screen, that is watering plants, exchanging their dresses and to participate in online events organized by different cultural groups. are again back in action with their favorite game hide and seek. Today we celebrate Eid al-Fitr that marks the end of holy month of Ramadan. As we cannot step out and join my family for the celebration, my father has come with food for us. This is our Eid feast with mom's special mutton biryani. Woke up to another beautiful morning. I was just thinking, on normal times if we come also, we won't end up spending more time in this place. Now we cannot go out anymore, it's really nice to be around nature. You can hear different birds, there are lots of butterflies, animals and I'm missing rain. Today kind of cloudy so I'm expecting that too. I don't know why this field is getting ploughed now. The entire field is gonna be under water as soon as the rain starts. Farming in this land will happen only after the monsoon is over, maybe some other reason for the job they are doing now. 
it's an absolute pleasure for me to share some small tips to boost your immune system during this quarantine period you may be already knowing this but someone may find it helpful few things to notice are good sleep lower your stress level do steaming at least once in a day have healthy balanced diet and make hydration a habit I got a surprise call from my brother and he's bringing a cake and it's my birthday As we are not stopping out for anything kids were so excited to see him This is my birthday cake and I'm so grateful for the love and care they are showing us during this time. I got wishes from so many friends telling that it's double celebration time because in Maharashtra Eid is today. So I thought even if I'm here I got a chance to celebrate it. As I told before it was a cloudy day. Heavy wind accompanied by thunderstorm and rain has started. I'm super happy. first rain of monsoon in this year and it's being raining heavily i read somewhere this rain eliminates harmful toxins from our land same like that i wish corona virus also get eliminated from the world spent 10 days in quarantine without any issues four more days to go see when i'm getting refreshed so do the nature bye bye